Okay. What's up? I tried them, and baby, when I say them things came out great, it was almost as if I had laid the stones myself. So I was like, oh my God, I am happy. The only thing is that some of the sands were not, um, were not what um, I would have created. The one that says blessed, I said it was going to give it a try tonight and put it on an item. And this is not what I'm used to picking up with. So, um, that one, do I got any more white spots that's missing? I don't know. Let's see. We can't see, we can't see, we can't see. I know y'all can't see what I'm doing. In a way, that's good. In a way, it's not good. It's good because you won't see me fumble around, like fumble the football. <laughs> you would not see me fumbling the football at all. So, uh, I guess you want to share your mistakes, but me personally, uh-uh, not a dot. I don't feel like that. <laughs> I just don't feel like it. So, uh, I don't know what I did with the crystal katana. Uh, I, I got addicted to the crystal katana. Uh, like I said, you get used to certain tools and you just go for it. So, this is how the Dollar Tree stock came out. This was a scarf. The scarf was plain like this right here. So I got the scarf like this from the Dollar Tree, right? Mm -hmm. Don't know why I got a scarf or not. But here are the stones that I purchased. So the whole total was $125, $125, $2.50. I think that's cute. I don't care what nobody said, but somebody go get this. I thought it turned out really cute. And then this one, you tell me that ain't cute. Look at that. I don't know if you can see it or not, but it says hope. Uh, let me put it up here. Ooh. It said hope somewhere. Hold on. You can't really see it up there. Maybe that's me. But this one says hope. So one dollar and a quarter for this little scarf. Dollar and a quarter for the stones that came just like this. And I'm going to show you the next one that I'm going to work on tonight. I don't think I'll do a scarf. I just was just trying to figure out what it look good on. Hold on. So. Oh. See, when I see stuff, I be buying too much of it. So here's another. These you can use with the iron. You do not have to have a heat press. This was the beauty of this. Look at this one. Iron on art. Crafter square. Really should have did a video about this, but I didn't. Um, maybe I will. Um, and here's the one that says hope. That's how that one looks. And then this one, look at that. It's like a leaf. You can either put it on a bag, they put it on the bag, or put it on the shirt. All iron on. I pressed them with a heat press because I didn't feel like getting on iron and ironing board out. I already had it. And now this one I melted. Unfortunately, this one I put on the bag. That one is detailed, it, but the stones are very small. They're about, I think one is a 10 and one is, one might be, these are the stones that I usually use on my nail art. So I think that one may be a six because the black stones are so small, but I wanted to try it. Don't knock it till you try it. Oh, here's one that says faith. I was gonna put that one on like a um, put that one on like either uh, what you call it? What you call it? I can't even say it. See the an apron? I thought that one would be cute on the apron, but they're all cute. They're all nice. Don't know why I picked them all up, but I did. Um, I burned one. I had a Coach bag. That was a gift out of, for some perfume. You know how you buy perfume and they give away all these bags? <sighs> well, I thought... <laughs> I'll make this a video too. I thought that I could press it. Well, I couldn't press it. So those are some of the uh, art things that, that, that we made. And 